Hi, it's Lori Pilgrim. I'm part of the design architect team for Maximo Scheduler. I wanted to show you a brief demo of the Graphical Work Week, which is a new application released with 768. It, this application allows you to do both scheduling and assigning. It, for scheduling, it's very dependent on the fact that you have the sync system property set to allow the scheduler dates to be synced to the assignment dates. So here, here's what I would do if I was doing some scheduling. On the bottom, we're showing both the resources uh, craft or crew type and the resources and their availability. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to collapse this. And when I collapse this, I'm looking just specifically at the load and availability, uh, like you would see in our original graphical scheduling application. So I'm going to go ahead and um, I selected the overhead line crew because you can see we're overloaded in that area. And what, what I'm going to do then is maybe just filter to all my low priority work and say OK. Um, I've already filtered my work to only see the overhead line crew requirements. And so that filtered the top view to that, and now I filtered to the low priority work. I can just go ahead and select all of that, and I can move it to the next week um, so that it's out of this week because I'm not going to be able to accomplish all of that. So if I move it to into the next week, I just pick, say, the Monday of the next week and say OK. And it's moved it, and what you can see is it's also updated my load and availability. And I would continue in that manner, picking work that I think I can move off until I'm happy with the load and availability left in this week before I start my assigning. So next I'm going to clear all my filters. So if I clear my filters, clear them here, turn this off, turn this off, expand. So now I'm going to start doing assignments. And the first thing I think I'll do is I'll do the carpenters. So I have lots of availability. What you will notice is that I have a vacation day set up here and I can um, do my modify my availability using these and I'll show you that in a minute. So it's giving me the hours that are available per shift. So if I select all of my carpenters and my carpenter craft and again apply my filter, I filter down to only the work that's uh, required in this week for the carpenters as you can see here and so what I can do then is just select a bunch according to my view or select all as I've done before and just do a double click on a resource and it will go ahead and show me because I'm going to go across multiple days it is going to go and show me that this is going to fill this person's day on the 14th, on the 15th, and on the 16th, it's, it's adding some hours. So if I say OK, it starts filling up that person's day. So Monday and Tuesday are filled up, some of Wednesday are, is filled up, and what you can see is that it's also added um, my allocation numbers here. If I do a single assignment, so I just picked a single one here and assign it. It won't come up with a dialog. It just goes ahead and does the assignment, reduces the hours um, for that person, and increases the allocation. If we have a color chart now, and it will show you the reason code colors because we've added colors to those, and the allocation colors. All of these are customizable to your uh, requirements. So, Let's say that I have done some of these assignments and then somebody calls in sick. So if I change this to a reason code of sick and I'll save the full day and I double click on Tuesday and they've called in sick. So now I've got an issue because this has gone red, right? So I need to do something about that. So if I um, right click on that, I can do unassign all once I've unassigned all, then I could probably check all of my carpenters and my required carpenters. You can see that they've made it as unassigned. And then I can reassign them again just by selecting them and assigning them to somebody else. So it does tell me who is qualified to do the work.
And that's a short demo of the new application. I hope you.